Welcome to this video tutorial from the Dolibar ERP and CRM system. In this video, we will look at how to work with the Users, Groups and Permissions module. The Users, Groups and Permissions module allows you to create and manage users on the Dolibar system. In most cases, it will be the employees, but it can also be external user accounts for your bookkeeper or other partners. Your employees can also log into the system and manage their account, activity and holidays and other functions depending on the applications you have enabled. Let's look at the common features. There are two user flows to the Users and Groups module, one as the employer or administrator and the other as the employee or external user. Let us first look at the administrator or employer user flow. Log in with an account that has administrator access. Click on the Users and Groups menu to access the user module. Click on List of Users to review the list of existing employees or users. The hierarchical view gives a bird's eye view of the employee hierarchy in the organization. Creating an employee or user. Click on New User to add a new employee, an internal user in your organization to the system. Fill out the required fields. If the user is an external user, a customer or a provider, you can set the property external user so that the user will only see information related to his or her account. You can choose whether the user is an employee and also pick a supervisor to set the hierarchy for managing the user's leave requests and expense reports. Fill in additional job details such as remuneration and weekly work hours. You can also upload documents and record bank information on user record. Note, if the user has been set as an external user, he or she will be able to view only the respective invoice, order, proposal, etc. and not any other order. This is unless you give the user permission to view all, like for example for your external bookkeeper. Access control and permissions Administrators are able to configure access control permissions for modules and module actions. Here are a list of actions available for access configuration with respect to the expense reports and leave request management modules. This also applies to all other modules in the Dollybar system. You can use groups to map users with permissions. Under the Users and Groups menu, click on Add Group. Once the group is created, click on the Group Permissions tab to assign the desired permissions to the group. Users added to the group will now inherit all the permissions assigned to the group. Employee Features Once the user is created and permissions are defined, the employee can log into the system and, depending on the permissions granted, can edit or not edit information. If the application leave has been enabled, you can click on the HRM tab menu to view the leave balance. The complete process of creation, approval and consultation of leaves is presented into the video about the leave module. If the module expense reports has been enabled, expense reports can be created from the respective menu. Expense reports thus created can be approved or rejected by the appropriate supervisor. The complete process of creation, approval and consultation of expense reports is presented into the video about the expense report module. If the module project and timesheets has been enabled, timesheets can be entered from the time spent menu. The complete process of creation of timesheets 
is presented into the video about the project module. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. Visit www.dollybar.org to learn more.